Currently, it holds mounds of dirt and city signs, but the corner of Richter and Clement may be the future location of the new Kelowna RCMP detachment. The city has identified that this building needs to be replaced. It's a big expenditure and it will have an impact on taxes. The 50-year-old building no longer meets required building codes and policing standards. However, the cost for the new facility will ring in at just over $42 million, which the city will borrow from the province and taxpayers would begin feeling the impact come 2015. In an effort to include residents in a public process, an open house will be hosted at the Royal Land Hotel where residents will be able to ask questions and voice concerns. So it's not going to be just an everyday office building, presumably it's going to have to have security and it's going to have to have, uh, you know, cells and that kind of thing. So I have to assume that the people who put the, you know, the, the dollar figure together know what they were doing. But it is, it's not an inconsequential amount of money. Uh, in comparison to, say, the brand new Four Points Hotel out by the airport, everything in there for $20 million. And now this is 48 million. I just can't see it. I mean, how old is our uh, current RCMP building? It's pretty old. So how many years of value did we get out of that? So maybe we can get another hundred years out of this new one. I don't see a problem with it, actually. Municipal voters will have 30 days to object to the project through electoral response forms. If less than 10% of the uh, voting uh, public of the citizens of Kelowna say no, uh, or sorry, uh, less than 10 percent, then uh, council will consider those n uh, numbers and they have the authority then to proceed with the board. The second open house will take place Monday, March 10th from 3.30 to 6.30 at the Royal Anne.